Every Jew has a portion in the world to come. Now, can you sell your portion, your spot in heaven? It seems to me there's a fellow who woke up a few days ago and decided to post his spot in heaven for sale on eBay. After 24 hours, it skyrocketed to $100,000. Someone offered $100,000 to buy his spot in heaven. Now, I want to discuss with you today, is it possible to sell your spot in heaven to somebody else? In order to understand this, we have to first plumb the depths in trying to comprehend what is heaven all about. Now, I cannot guarantee to explain to you what heaven is because I haven't been there, but based on the teachings of our rabbis, I could tell you that heaven is very similar to a relationship. Our rabbis teach us that in this world we're here to build a relationship with the divine, with the Almighty. Torah and mitzvahs are given as a vehicle and a medium to develop that relationship. So imagine you meet a girl and you work on that relationship for a year or so, buying her flowers, writing her cards, and after a year, she's in love with you. And you go to a friend and you say, I'd like to sell that relationship to you. It doesn't work. Now we know in the story of Aladdin, even the genie told Aladdin that one of the wishes he can guarantee him is to force someone else to fall in love with him. You can't force love and you cannot sell relationships. So I believe that if you wake up one morning and decide to do the same, it doesn't work.